Well, hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to be making for you a very unique dish. Um, it's a dish that we treasure in our island of Jamaica. It's a brown stew cow foot, full of flavor, full of taste. And I'm going to show you how we do it. Let's get right into it. So first we're going to wash and clean up our cow foot. In this case I bought four pounds and I'm squeezing some lime juice on there. I'm going to, I'm going to wash it thoroughly. Remove any excess fat or hair that's on the foot or trimmings that shouldn't be there. And I'm just using room temperature water to wash my cow foot. Most of the time this cow foot already come pre-cut into small pieces. As you can see in the video these were all cut. Now we're going to just add some seasoning to it. So I'm using a teaspoon of table salt. And now I'm going to add some smoked paprika. I'm using about a teaspoon of smoked paprika. And now we're adding roughly two teaspoons of black pepper. And a tablespoon of adobo all-purpose seasoning. To that we're going to add roughly about a tablespoon of browning for color. And now we're just going to use our hands to combine all the ingredients. And now into the pressure cooker we're going to add a little bit of vegetable oil. And now we're going to add each piece of our cow foot into the pot. Now we're gonna add roughly a cup and a half of water to the bowl that we had our, that we seasoned our cow foot in and we're gonna pour that water onto our cow foot in the pressure cooker. Once it starts boiling, we're gonna put our pressure cooker lid on and we're gonna pressure cook for approximately 47 minutes. This is what our meat looks like after 47 minutes. It's nice and soft and it's still intact. It's not completely like dissolved. So into a cast iron pot, I'm gonna add some oil and we're gonna saute our vegetables. I'm adding some chopped onions, some bell peppers, and some ginger, and a few cloves of garlic. We're gonna add roughly a teaspoon of all-purpose seasoning to our vegetables. Just give it a little stir in the pot. Now we're going to add some chopped carrots. We're going to add the broth from our pressure cooked uh, cow foot. So we're putting the meat to the side. We're just going to saute our vegetables, make sure they're nice and soft. And I'm going to add roughly a cup of beef, beef broth to our vegetables. And we're going to give that a nice little mix. To that, I'm gonna add roughly a tablespoon of soy sauce for taste and flavor, and roughly a tablespoon of tomato ketchup. Again, for taste and flavor. We're gonna give that a nice little mix. Let it come to a boil. Once our vegetables are partially cooked, we're just going to add back our cow foot in and uh, just let them simmer and cook for another 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, um, should be ready for your plate. I'm going to add a little bit of oregano, very good herb, you know, um, add a tremendous amount of flavor to your meat sauce and to your meat as well. We're going to give that a mix. And now here's the final result. Everything came out very good. 
the meat was soft and tender, chewy, gooey, full of taste, full of flavor. And we served the cow food with some steamed Napa cabbage and kale over some rice. Once again, guys, I really appreciate you taking the time out to watch and listen. And um, hope you enjoy this video. If you do, please leave a like and comment and share. Um, and I look forward to seeing you again in the next video. Have a blessed day.